When Blaine Talbot was teething and in pain, his mom Karina bought Highland homeopathic teething tablets. They said natural on the label, so she thought they were safe. But then she noticed an alarming change in her baby boy. He started having seizures. That scared me to death. The seizures stopped when the tablets ran out, and Blaine is now a healthy four-year-old. But the teething product, later recalled by the FDA, for harmful levels of belladonna, a plant-based poison, now linked to the deaths of 10 children and injuring 400 more. The company says there is no scientific link between seizures and their product. Now the FDA planning to crack down on the safety of many homeopathic products, a $3 billion industry that's never been regulated. They think they're taking an active ingredient that is, is going to benefit them, and, and that's where the scam is. That's where the snake oil part of this is. The FDA plans to target high-risk products first, ones given by injection, used by children and the elderly, and marketed for cancer, heart disease, opioid, and alcohol addictions. Natural product advocates are pushing back. Homeopathic products have been used safely since the 1700s, and we're sure the agency will factor that into any regulatory decisions. The FDA will take input on their new approach for 90 days. Katie Beck, NBC News, Atlanta. If you have carpal tunnel syndrome, just do what 50,000 others have done to cure their symptoms. Get the Carpal RX. The Carpal RX cures your carpal tunnel symptoms for good. It's that simple. Don't suffer a minute longer. Order your Carpal RX now. Go to carpalrx.com for more details.